this is hydrogen tap. What we're looking at here is a second video in this series of the miniature hydrogen oxygen separation process. I'm trying to create a system that I can sell for less than $30 to bring more people into the project. We've got two plates. The one on the left is going to make the hydrogen. The one on the right is going to make the oxygen. We're putting lye in here on this video. I'm going to do the same thing and show you with salt and maybe one other electrolyte. What I've done here is just drop the lye in. And I haven't mixed it up. We're just going to take a look at it and see what happens. Notice the tube in between. What has to happen is the lye has to go between the two tubes. We are getting some kind of hydrogen coming up there, as you can see, but not very much. Again, this is the miniature series that I'm going to try to sell for less than $30 if it works. This is the first time I've tried to make this work. In the last video, I showed the system as I was putting it together. Not quite sure putting plates this far apart would work, but it seems to be doing something. You can see the plate on the left is producing hydrogen. The plate on the right is producing oxygen. Not very much at this point. We just put lye into it, but I didn't mix it. And in just a second, we'll mix it up. And we'll see actually what this will do. What I'm going to do after this, using the lye, I'm going to put salt in it in the next video. Remember, this is just for experimenting with. This is not supposed to produce a tremendous amount of hydrogen. Now we're going to put more lye in. And remember, I still haven't mixed the water together. So what you're seeing here is just strictly the water going from one tube to the other, but not very much mixture. Again, you can see a little bit of bubbles on the left side. We're going to fix that in just a moment. What I'm going to do is mix the water completely together. And uh, we should see a tremendous difference. Right now, I'm just mixing the water in the separate vessels. And that's not going to do too much better, as you can see. We are getting a little more hydrogen out. We have to get the lye to go between the two. And right now, it's there's a lock between the two. Again, this is the miniature system. If you go to hydrogentap.com, you're going to see more pictures of this as soon as I get them up. What I'm doing now is pouring them together so the lime mix is good in the water, and we'll pour it back in. After I do this, we'll hook it up, and you're going to see a tremendous difference. You can see the connector tube between them. That's where the electrons are going to flow. So the stainless steel on the left is going to produce hydrogen. The stainless steel on the right is going to produce oxygen. It's very simple and old experiment. If this works well, then I will try to sell it for around $30 or less. Also, there's going to be a top on this, and you'll see. Put a top on this, and uh, it would be a very nice test unit. Now you can see a lot of hydrogen being produced on the left side. The right tube 
is producing oxygen. See as the hydrogen starts moving around in there. Again, these tubes are going to be covered. Right now it's pulling around 30.33 amps. at about 13 volts.